Good evening. Good heavens, Ranjit, you're actually here on time. Yes. Well done. Uh, You're my lady? Oh, yes. Thank you, man. And uh, thank you for carrying it. De nada, hombre. Permítame que le quite el abrigo, por favor. Oh, yes. Thank you very much. Sí. Thank you. <laughs> ya sabe usted que aquí estoy yo para servirle, señor. Bravo. Porque yo la atenderé siempre bien. Usted. You Spanish creeper. You. <laughs> you an Italian cuticle. Yeah, all right, settle down, everybody. We've got a, a lot of work to do tonight. Right. Squeeze, please. Uh, just sit down a minute, Harry, will you? No, thank you. I'm only coming to tell you I'm not coming. Not coming? <laughs> yes, please. Well, uh, but you can't leave in the middle of a term. I mean, you were doing quite well. Why do you want to leave? Oh, blimey. I'm coming up on the puddles. Coming up on the puddles? <laughs> yes, please. The football puddles. Oh, the football pool. <laughs> yes, and I'm getting eight scoring draws. How many draws on the cup on? Only the eight I'm getting. Huh? How much do you win? Oh, blimey. It could be half a million pounds. Oh, yes. Santa Maria! Oh, I'm very happy for you because you are my best friend. <laughs> He's also my friend. <laughs> Amigo mío, hombre. <laughs> I am the true friend of Ali. <laughs> you? But of course, we are practically bloody brothers. <laughs> I thought you didn't like Muslims. I love Muslims. Especially when they're having you half a million pounds. Yes. Well, I don't know what to say, Ali. I mean, I'm very pleased for you, of course. I'm also being very pleased for me. Yeah, what will you do? Oh, blimey, I'm going to the bed. To bed? Yes, please. With all that money, I'm not needing to be working, so I'm going to bed. Yeah, you mean you're going to retire? Most definitely. Yeah. You're quite sure you've got eight score drawers? Oh, yes. Hmm? I got the copy. Here, please. The one I'm picking off. I see. Yeah, well, Ali, I don't think you're going to be able to retire just yet. You mean he's not got the eight drawers? Oh, yes. He's got the eight... He's got eight drawers, but, Oh, good. Uh, they're not all on the same line. What difference is that making? Well, it means you haven't won anything. No. Nothing at all? Nothing at all. Yeah. Ha! Bellos! Yeah. 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 No! Yeah. 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 Typical of that Muslim tweak. No brains whatsoever. Oh, blimey. You are changing tune. When you are thinking that I am very wealthy, you are being my bloody brother. That is because I am finding out you are bloody stupid. Don't you call me bloody stupid, you bearded baboon. Yes. Yes. Why the pair of you and, and sit down? I, I presume you are staying now, Ali. I am staying now, yes. Good. Right, now this evening I thought we'd... Constable Wilkins? Where the devil are you? You should have been back here by now. Pardon? No, I will not send a panda car for you. I don't care if someone has pinched your bicycle. Pinch somebody else's. <laughs> Would you like a cup of tea? A tea? A cup of cha. Cha? Oh, yes, please. No, thank you. Or sugar. Don't <laughs> run away. Ah, Jamila, are you all right? Oh, oh Shukare Master Ji, you guys come here to save me. Tell me to save them. What did she say, Ali? Shukare Master Ji, you guys come here to save me. In English. Oh, excuse me, please. She's saying that she's very glad that we are coming to help her escape. <laughs> Let, ask her what she stole. Hey, what did you steal? No, I didn't steal. I had written on the Rizal that it was free in the Mufat. So I took it. Now people say that you have stolen it. Well, nothing. She must have said more than that. Yes, please. She's saying that she took a book from the newspaper shop, but the book was free. Well, there's obviously been some misunderstanding. I'll, I'll sort it out with the police. Will they be sending her to prison? No, 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 no. Uh, nothing as drastic as that. I'll have a word with the sergeant. Uh, five pounds ought to do it. Ah, I'm understanding. That is a fine. No, no, no. It's not exactly a fine. Uh, let's just say it's a little gift. Gift? Yes, it's an old English custom. I scratch your back, you scratch mine. Ah, you scratch my back, I scratch yours. That's right. Very well. What are you being itchy? No, no, no. It's fine. <laughs> sure. God help me. Good evening. Good evening. Are you Mr. Brown? 
No, he's Mr. Brown. I was speaking to him. <laughs> yeah, this is the right first time. Who are you? Ali Nadim. No, I am Ali Nadim. You are Mr. Brown. Yes, <laughs> Ali, I'll do the talking, all right? You just leave it to me. Now, I'm sure we can sort this out, Inspector. The Commissioner looks after promotions here, sir. Yes, well, uh, you look like an inspector. I'm sure it's only a matter of time. May I compliment you on your station and what a wonderful job you're doing? Thank you, sir. Yes. Now, about this young lady. Ah, yes. I... Thank you, sir. Yes. Now, about this young lady. Ah, yes. I expect you'd uh, like to have a look at my driving licence. What for? Well, to verify my identity. You said you were Mr Brown. Yes, but you want some proof, don't you? Look, if you tell me you're Mr Brown, I accept that as the truth. Yes, but I could have been lying. Were you lying? Uh, no, he's uh, definitely Mr. Brown. He's telling the truth. Ali, <laughs> I insist you look at my driving license. Oh, very well, if it'll make you happy. Is this yours, sir? Pardon? This five-pound note. It was inside your driving license. Are you sure? It could have dropped out of your trouser pocket. Oh, yes. And dropped upwards, I suppose, onto the desk. <laughs> oh, you might have had it tucked up your sleeve. Yes, and I could have a couple of doves up the other, but I haven't. It was definitely in your licence. Yes, Sergeant, is correct. I remember you putting it there not a moment ago. <laughs> I forgot. It was just before you said you scratch my back and I scratch yours. <laughs> Thank you, George Washington. No, I am Ali. Yes, Ali, just, just be quiet, please. Now, Sergeant, about this young lady. Yes, the accused. Yes, well, remember British justice. I mean, a person is presumed innocent until proven guilty, and this poor lady is innocent. I know that. I mean, just because she's an immigrant, you can't go picking... Pardon? Oh, she pinched the book, all right. But she thought it was Bakshi. See what it says on the front cover? But free inside, colour supplement. That's right. Oh, and she thought the whole thing was free? Yes. Ah, well, then it's not her fault. If anyone's to blame, it's the person who's been teaching her English. <laughs> it's not always easy. Well, if that's all, we'll be getting along. Come along, Jamila. <sighs> oh, but I tell them I must... Before you go, sir, would you like to make a donation to our police charity fund? Yes, well, you've caught me at uh, rather an awkward moment. What about the fiver? You remember, sir? The one you thought you never had. Oh, that fiver. You know what they say, sir? What you've never had, you never miss. <laughs> Unless, of course, you knew it was there all the time. In which case, it would come under bribery and corruption. <laughs> you scratch my back, and I'll scratch yours. 